Jasmine and Tyler are here with Wizard of Paws Wildlife, and you brought some friends with you this you morning. Did. Morty and Mouse, correct? Yes, this that's one what is we're Morty. calling you right now. And Hi, this Morty. Is Mouse. <laughs> Hi, Morty. Hi, Mouse. Okay, so Ty. Ridgeback. Yes, there are only four breeds in the whole world that actually have this ridge going down their spine where their hair grows backwards. Look at that. And I um, see that. This, these guys are one of those four breeds. Now, wow. this breed is uh, still considered a primitive breed dog, so they need somebody who actually has experience handling strong dogs that are independent. Okay. Like, you know, Malinois, Shepherds, um, okay. and even uh, another primitive breeds like Akitas and stuff like that. Right, so sure. We, um, we, we require uh, these these guys they have such a high prey drive but because Morty is we think he's half lab he actually does get along with our cat so he could actually go home with well that's what I wondered other anyone. animals other is it better for no children um, they're kind of strong these guys are still young so we're saying 10 and uh, up okay um, with the age on adoption um, we have their father too and we're saying uh, no no kids no, no, kids. Small. no, no kids. small animals no other dogs. Okay, okay. How are they temperament wise? I mean, they seem to be pretty good. They can get a little bossy. Oh, like, as oh, you see, you mouse, guys are mouse bossy. Is, yeah, mouse is a little You're bossy. bossy. But, um, so he, he likes to try and tell bossy. Morty's pretty submissive, so he tells Morty where to. <laughs> you know, he's like, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. And if, if you look at their tongues uh, when they're panting, they have spotted tongues. These dogs can also have black tongues. And they can um, it also have oh, uh, pink yeah. tongues, which are not acceptable by breed standards. Oh, wow. Because they're I, just now starting to be accepted. So AKC has them in foundation mm -hmm. stock. So um, they're only 300 in the United Look at States. That. See that spotted tongue? Yeah, I see it. <laughs> but you said, I mean, yeah, they're pretty rare. They're, they're pretty rare in the U.S. In Thailand, they're very popular. They're actually cobra hunting dogs. Wow. They hunt snakes. Um, really? So, yeah, they would, uh, they would actually keep them under the house so they could actually get rid of oh uh, snakes that get underneath our houses. Okay, well, Tyler, tell me, what do people need to know if perhaps they're interested and might want to inquire about these guys? Well, we have an adoption application on our website. Okay. So they can either go there or they just send an email, mm -hmm. give us a phone call. All right, give us a phone call. That's easy enough. What else is going on with you guys right now? Uh, we're actually trying to raise the funds to buy a farm property. Um, oh. So that way we can expand our sanctuary and uh, look more into the genetics of these primitive breed dogs. Yeah. So we want to be able to do a lot more science and we want to be able to save a lot more animals from uh, situations like these guys were That's put fantastic. in. So well, and speaking of that, I know it's very important when we talk about adoption stories with dogs, that you, you don't want to just get caught up in that moment, especially mm -hmm. during a holiday or something like yes. that. This is a big responsibility, this, but this also um, a very big part of your life, too. It can bring a lot of love and a lot yes. of joy. So just really think about yes. things like that, right? Yes. We actually um, have a pretty strict... Um, uh, check that we do when, yeah. when it comes to primitive dogs and, and exotic pets. We mm -hmm. want to make sure that the people don't have any kind of animal cruelty yeah. charges against them in the past right. and stuff like Absolutely. that. So make sure that they're taken care of. Yeah. Well, if you guys are interested, of course, you can visit Wizard of Paws, uh, wildlife.org. We'll put that link on IndieStyle.tv. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Morty. <laughs> Thanks, Thank Mal. Thanks for having Thank us. You. We really appreciate it. You're so welcome. <laughs> All right, Tracy. Oh, he's giving me kisses. Handsome, handsome. Kisses. Lots of new dining options around Indy. Jolene Ketzenberger tells us where to find them when Indy Style continues.